And now... Now we're gonna get a drink and then we're gonna do something that he's never done before! Money! Bitch, I'm making money! Okay, what's in the Uber? Are you my Moo Mal? That is cr- or Lyft. Are you my Moo Mal? So weird. A mother bird sat on her egg. <laughs> well, you're not. <laughs> I'm not gonna read the whole thing. Not gonna read the whole thing. <laughs> no. But of all things, I have one thing in my school bag right now, and it's and another you also children's have book. A Duke, uh, Dr. Seuss. That's book. not Ch Dr. Seuss, but it's definitely it's Dr. Seuss influenced. It's not. No, no. But it's yeah. kind of weird. Children's book. Well, I'm thinking about getting this note from my dad. What a ride. Hey. You're gonna get So here we are at the first apartment me and Keiki ever lived at many a year ago. I'm not gonna go in, so don't get your hopes up. We used to live up here above a pizza shop, and it's crazy. When I graduated college, we lived here. My grandma, who was like 87, rest in peace, she walked up these steps to this tiny little apartment. And we're just having a nostalgic moment thinking about it. Keiki's filming right now. Hi, Keiki! Hi! <laughs> And, um, yeah, so, just feeling nostalgic walking through my home, Westchester. It's pretty wild. We lived up there, we lived with another roommate, and it was, uh, wild. We lived above a pizza shop, and I swear we were paying their electric bill because it was like 200, what was it, like a 100 square foot apartment? Yeah. And, like, our electric bill was like $400. Yeah. No way! We, mm. That was our electric No bill. way. So we lived across the street from Fenario, the coffee shop. We'll get there and um, I'll tell you another story. So we're walking through town and we just saw the back of our first apartment. I said it was above a pizza shop. That was Benny's Pizza, I'll show you. Ready? Uh, right here. This is the pizza shop, Benny's. It's one of the oldest in town. Yo, what's up man? And where is it? There it is, Benny's Pizza. We lived above it. And one time, I was up there, right on that roof, right there. And I was like, Keiki, I think I see Bam Margera at that, at that coffee shop right there. Let's go over there. And I was like, you know what? If by the time I walk down the steps, which I took my time because I was so nervous, if he's still there, I'm gonna introduce myself. Sure enough, he was. And it was right here. He's parked with his Hummer. And I introduced myself. I was like, my name's Mike Nebby. Uh, I'm a real big fan. Uh, I would love to play you a song. I played him a song, and the rest is history. So that's our history with Benny's Pizza. What? Yeah. So we lived. Where we did everything in one room. And this coffee shop is where I played a song that got me to see the world. And this woman is the reason why. <laughs> And then just for anyone that understands the history of Westchester at all, right up here on the corner is Fairman Skate Shop, which obviously is the iconic skate shop. A little history of dubstep, right? Yee. 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 And now... Now we're gonna get a drink and then we're gonna do something that he's never done before. You hear that? <laughs> I'm gonna do something I've never done before. <laughs> Ever. Oh wow. My God. This whole town has changed since I left 102 days ago. It's fucking crazy. There used to be a building here. Everything's changing. It opens up Fairman so much. Wow. How about this? The few times I've ever busked was on this corner right here. I, was, I made like $80 an hour. I worked like two, two hours in playing on the corner. I made like 150 bucks. Was able to pay our rent at the time. Crazy. So, this is Dub C. I think we're gonna go get a drink and then I'm gonna do something I've never, never done, done before! before. <laughs> she, she was in Should we say what we're doing? Something that he's never done before. <laughs> well, I think it's time. We're going. No, no. Something you've never done before. Okay. Don't tell it yet. Alright. Well, we're still working, we walking through the town of this place. our hometown. <laughs> I know where it's at. 
Um, Do you? Yeah. But well, we can go this way. Where are we going? I don't Up know. Up here and into the right. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, I've never done something like this before. But um, I did talk about it in the lift, so I have to make sure to edit out that lift part. So right now you have no idea what I'm talking about. And Kiki's just being a rock star and not speaking. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. I don't know. This is where I got my first thing that I've never done before. Right here, right? Right there. Yeah. Right back there. That's crazy. Damn. Well, and this is the bar from the vlog the last time I was home in PA. So I used to play my first shows right here, right there. Jesus Christ, bad. And there's yeah. not even a stage there anymore. Wow. First time I played here, I brought 60 people, and then I got a gig every week for a year. Hey. And then I got charged on it because the bar claimed me for all of the money hey. that the whole band made. And that was my first time understanding the IRS. Don't fuck with them. Love you, IRS. Okay. Kiki's being all anxious, but here we are. Tattoo. Gonna get my first one. Let's see what we got. Where are we at, Kiki? She always finds dogs. Where are we at? Okay. Where are we at? Extreme end, come on. Extreme end? Extreme end. Where? Okay. Where are we going? Extreme end in Westchester. We're getting tattoos. We're getting tattoos. Going big. Not Go going big. home. Going big. Going big because I am at home. Yeah. yeah. First one. First you, tattoo ever. I guess you will have to wait to see what we get. She already has a ta tattoo. <laughs> My first one ever. Tattoo. Try not to think about anything. Just go with it and not regret it. That's life. That's what it's all about. Here we are at Extreme Inc. in Westchester, <laughs> Pennsylvania, our hometown. Until next time. The girl that has tattoos is nervous. What is that about? I only have one horrible tattoo. It's not visible. This one's going to be visible. Forever. Huh? Forever. I never had a tattoo. I'm just not thinking about it. This whole tattoo. Just uh, go all in. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Next time you see us, we'll be getting inked up. <laughs> Bye. At Extreme Ink, get my first one with my pops writing on it. Well, I did it. I'm at Extreme Inc. in Westchester, Pennsylvania, and I got something my dad wrote to me when I graduated college, what a ride, and I thought, what better thing to do than put a pine tree on the East Coast side and a palm tree on the West Coast side. Permanent. Forever. I like it. Is it the last one? I don't know. Cakey's crying because she got a tattoo. Look at her. Real tears. Put it up to the camera. I just really love it. And he really did exactly what I wanted. It's very delicate and very small. Explain what and, it is. Um, it's our house. It's our house with our palm tree and our chimney. No, and we then... don't have a palm tree. That's a pine tree. Pine tree. What did I say? Palm tree. Okay. It's our house with a pine tree and our chimney. And then the bottom half is, is like a sun with some... X's and I just am so completely obsessed with her. I'm so happy. <laughs> Thumbnail. Kiki, we got a tattoo and Casey cried right here. Bing! I want to see your tattoo. Mine, I got my dad's writing. What a ride. I already have a feeling people are going to make fun of me for that tagline. What that a ride. not going to be made fun of at all. And on the east coast side is a pine tree and on the west coast side is a palm tree. Rest in peace, Pop. How are you feeling about your tattoo? How are you feeling I about your tattoo? so over the moon with ta my tattoo. Who designed your tattoo? I designed my tattoo. Yeah? Myself. I drew it myself. 
archived it myself, and here it is. You wanna see it again? All Take right. a look. Let's zoom in. Describe it again and point to it. Look at Take that blood. Take a look. Oh, that Here's my blood. Here's my house. Here's my pine tree. Who bought that house? Here's my chimney. Who bought that house? I bought that house. Hey, here's my house, our house. Wait, who bought it? We did. No, who bought it? I did. Because you're a boss. I did. You bought that house. Underneath. It's our house, but you bought it. Underneath is, it was supposed to be the sun. It didn't turn out to be the sun in the end, but it is representative of the sun in California. We will live one day. But our house will be forever tattooed on my fucking arm because I am the fucking coolest. I'm so proud of myself. I love it so much. <laughs> She's cool. I ain't gonna deny that. I love it. And how about mine? You like it? You like it? Oh my god. It is so That's a terrible picture. perfect. So perfect. First tattoo. Wait, wait, wait. Get a, get a close up. Alright. Get a close up of your fucking cool ass tattoo. I'll do it. Let's zoom in on that. And just tap. Oh my goodness. We'll put a picture in there. Put Look a picture at that right here. Palm tree. Of no wrap. Right here. Picture. Boom. And then it says, What a ride in Mike's dad's handwriting. Mike's dad, rest in peace. Amazing. He wrote this in a book for you when you graduated. Cue the book here. Here's the book. There's the palm tree. There's the pine tree. And that's representative of Palm and Away. My pop predicting the future. And, and then right here we'll cue the page where my mom actually wrote in the book that one day I would go to Hollywood. <laughs> many yeah. years. Many we'll years. Many years apartment. before I actually did. Shout out mom. Mom. And now we're gonna walk to one of our other old apartments. Oh my god, what a Damn. So this was our first apartment we lived in for a long time. We lived here for seven years. This first floor was my studio. The second floor was the kitchen and lounge where Casey was, and the third floor was our bedroom. Seven years. Seven years, Kay. Hey. That's a long time. I worked at Starbucks here. A lot of the music I started making is now out, and it was created here, man. Here. So much shit happened in this apartment. So before Casey was a boss and she bought her first house, we uh, lived there for seven years, man. Seven freaking years. Walnut Street. Money. Bitch, I'm making money. I'm making all this money. I won't let anyone stop me. Cause all they do is block me. And they 